Hello. Today we will be discussing the word families in Hop on Pop by Dr. Seuss. So just by looking at the title, OP, 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 that's what I mean by word families. So if we look at the word family up, UP, that's something we may want to point out to our young readers and let them know that UP, the sound up, is going to come up in other words. And eventually as they grow older, they'll see UP in words like upward, upper, uproot, break up, shape up. And it'll just make it easier for when they encounter new words, they'll be able to recognize some of these word families and make those connections a little quicker. If you look at the word family, ouse, mouse, ouse. Um, spouse, oust, again, these are just word families that are going to come up in other words as they continue reading. All, stall, hall, um, other words with all in it. Just, and then again, just explaining, identifying these word families for our young readers will just let them know that they're going to see them again in bigger and harder words. Then we have A Y. That's going to come up in words like players, far away, dismay, wayward, night, fight, the it, i-g-h-t, flight, sight, short-sighted, enlighten. Again, these word families are going to come up in big words. And if they're able to identify and make connections to these word families, when they come across bigger words, it's going to be a lot easier to decode, to sound out. E, so many words have an E at the end of it. I am, dim, swim, prelim, impartial, I am also comes at the beginning of words, impractical. So I am pointing out that word family. It's going to make those connections a little faster for our young readers. And when you're pointing out the word families, you can kind of just ask them what they see, that these words have that are the same. You don't have to explain maybe that they're going to see them in bigger words. Maybe that might be too confusing for them. But just so that they're recognizing these word families, um, e, e, absentee, agree, need. E, E comes, comes a lot. Ed. Ed is a word ending. Um, it's something educated, educated, ed. Something they're going to see for the rest of their lives. It'd be nice for them to recognize that it's a word family and that they're all the same. Just so they're being cognizant of that. A, T, diplomat, aristocrat. Atlas. Again, just awesome word families. Add. Um, triad, clad, administer, advance. Identifying these word families in the long run, looking at the bigger picture of literacy and reading, they're going to see these word families in bigger words, and it's just going to be a lot easier for them to read them. ING. I mean, there's a million words with ING endings. Ong, strong, prolong, congress, again, just identifying these word families, just pointing them out. You know, once you can read walk, you could read talk. Once you can read song, you could read long. Making them aware of these word families is really good. Stalk, night, walker, walkers, again, just the ALK, they're going to see that in a lot of big words. Hop, op, shop, prop. Option, optimistic, stop. Again, once they can say hop, they can say pop and stop because they now know the word endings here, the, the word families. Brown, throne, grown, ownership, known, O-W-N, own. It's going to come up in a lot of words. Brown, down, Just making those connections helps for our young readers. Talking about those connections, town. Again, um, A -L A C K, track, acknowledge, crackers, just A C K is going to come up a lot. And just being cognizant of these word families is going to help our readers in the long run. Jump, U M P, dump, umpire, pumpkin, trumped, just, you know, him, the reader recognizing the U M P. In the long run, it's going to help him help the student identify other words. Ant, E-N-T, 
AST blast cast plastic astronaut tent um, movement ent enter excellent ANT comes up in a lot of words wet um, get jacket planet eternal ELP help yelp um, that's all I could think of <laughs> ELP comes up in a, a lot of other words I imagine um hill uh, will still treadmill illness illustrate brilliant illiant brilliant I L L just recognizing these word families once you can say will you can say hill and still because you know that I you know the sound for I L L father mother other those will come up it's just they're closing the book now um we're getting to the end Again, just my father can read big words too, like Constantinople and Timbuktu. Your student, your reader, your child, whoever is reading this book, you're reading this book too. Um, they're going to be able to read these bigger words now that they're recognizing these word families. Say, A Y, daylight, interlayers, interplay, A Y just comes up in a lot of words. Just being cognizant of these word families will help readers in the long run, sort of the long term goal of reading. Yeah, that was Word Families using Hop on Pop with Dr. Seuss. Thank you.